Harris Ulin is an American actor who has appeared in over a hundred film and television series roles, such as Scarface, Ghostbusters 2, Looking for Richard, The Hurricane, Training Day, and Frasier which earned him a Primetime Emmy Award nomination in 1996. Early life, Ulin was born in Los Angeles, California. Career Yulin made his New York debut in 1963 in Next Time I'll Sing to You by James Saunders and continued to work frequently in theatre throughout his career. His Broadway debut came in 1980's Watch on the Rhine. He has returned to Broadway multiple times in productions of The Visit featuring Jane Alexander, The Diary of Anne Frank, The Price, and Hedda Gabler featuring Kate Burton and Michael Emerson. In 2010 he played Willie Loman the lead role in Death of a Salesman at the Gate Theatre in Dublin, Ireland. His first prominent film role was his portrayal of Wyatt Earp and Doc, 1971, starring Stacey Keach as Doc Holliday. He is notable in the Brian De Palma film Skullface's corrupt cop Mel Bernstein. In 1989, he played the role of loud and obnoxious judge Stephen Wexler in Ghostbusters 2. He later appeared in Star Trek, Deep Space Nine in the episode duet. During the second season of the TV series 24, he played the director of the National Security Agency Roger Stanton. He was nominated for a 1996 Emmy for his portrayal of crime boss Jerome B. Lisco in the sitcom Frasier. In the series Buffy the Vampire Slayer, he played Quentin Travers, head of the Watchers Council. Yulin also appeared in season 3 of Entourage, in the episode Return of the King, as studio head Arthur Goodoff. In 2009, he performed in The People Speak, a documentary feature film that uses dramatic and musical performances of the letters, diaries, and speeches of everyday Americans, based on historian Howard Zinn's A People's History of the United States. In 2010 he appeared in the AMC series Rubicon. In addition to acting, Yulin won acclaim as a director for his work on the trip to Bountiful at Signature Theatre in New York with Lois Smith. Personal life, Yulin was married to actress Gwen Wells until her death in 1993. TV and filmography. References. External links, Harris Yulin at the Internet Movie Database, Harris Yulin at the Internet Broadway Database.